The coroner's office and area funeral homes are bracing for a significant rise in coronavirus deaths. State health officials say 55 more Nevadans have died from the virus. That brings the total to nearly 3,400 deaths statewide. 13 Action News reporter Sean Delancey is live at the Southern Nevada Health District to explain how funeral homes are preparing. Sean. Yeah, Kelsey, this is another tragic reminder of the toll that this global pandemic is having on families right here in Southern Nevada as the coroner's office sends refrigerated trailers to area funeral homes just to deal with the increase in deaths. Right now, the Associated Press is reporting that interim Clark County coroner Michael Murphy has distributed nine 20 to 40 foot containers with special shelving to area funeral homes to hold bodies before burial or cremation and three more are ready to go. Murphy told the AP that Southern Nevada was fortunate to have gotten these early in the pandemic because other regions are now competing for the limited number of them across the country. In Los Angeles, for example, the coroner's office has expanded their capacity from 500 to 2000 by creating a temporary morgue. The state and county brought in 10 53 foot refrigerated trailers just to hold bodies. The Southern Nevada Health District says 42 people died in this region on Thursday alone. 2,566 people have died in Southern Nevada since the beginning of this pandemic back in March. Sean Delancey, 13 Action News.